What's cracking YouTube? My name's Brody and welcome to another Pokemon trading card game opening and today we're back with a break evolution box and if you guys cannot see this thing just does not fit on my camera like I don't know I'll, I'll pull it back like it is freaking huge like look at this thing and it just looks so good it looks that good but yeah as you guys can see on the packaging it just says with uh, never before seen promo break so we've got um uh, Empoleon Break, Noctowl Break, and Behem Break with the Jumbo Empoleon Break. I believe this is the first Jumbo Break card they have ever created. So that is awesome. And then of course we've got the boost packs. We've got um, one Ancient Origins, one Roaring Skies, and three Breakthrough. But um, let's have a look on the back before we get straight into this thing. What does it say? Let's go into hand mode. Break out of the ordinary. Uh, Break Evolution is the newest way to power up your Pokemon, and this box contains not one, but three Pokemon Break plus a fantastic oversized card. Make a break for victory with the Pokemon TCG Break Evolution box today. But yeah, that is the contents just there. Pretty much what I just went through. But yeah, without further ado, I'm actually going to have a quick little fast forward section today because this, I can already foresee, is going to take a little while to get into. So I'll see you guys when I get back from that. Alrighty guys, and we're back, so, so, the contents, like, that took way too long, I was, just, like, really retarded to, like, get everything out, it was all just placed weirdly, 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 but here is the Jumbo Break card, like, look at that shine, it is ridiculous, it actually looks pretty good, um, but yeah, there's, like, I kind of just realised, on that, um, it, there's no real kind of texture to it, it's just, like, a full disco light shine, but, um, yeah, 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 so let's throw that one on the back. Of course you get the code card, I'm going to keep that one for myself, 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 but the um, codes from these packs here today will be all yours, all yours to the viewers. But um, also, before we get into those packs, we've got the break cards, the featured breaks. So we've got the Behemoth break, it's got 130 HP with Cosmic Circle. So Cosmic Circle says, uh, move as many psychic energy attached to your Pokemon to your other Pokemon in any way you like. So it does 100 damage, and then you also get to kind of like rearrange and reset up everything. So awesome! Let's throw that one at the back. The back. Noctowl break. So it's it's um got 130 HP with the attack at night scan, which says your opponent reveals his or her hand. This attack does 30 more damage for each trainer card you find there. So nice, nice. So if you're uh it's got a lot of uh, trainers on the go, on the go you can use that against them, so not bad, Noctowl. And then of course we've got the featured break card, I call it the featured because the Jumbo is the Empoleon as well. Um, it's got 170 HP with Emperor's Command which says this attack does 30 damage times the number of Pokemon your opponent has in play. So yeah, that could um, potentially do some damage, some solid damage. But yeah, you gotta be kind of in a, like a losing situation where they're pretty set up for that to um, come through. But I might actually stand these guys up upright. So yeah, let's go like that. Awesome, awesome, because I got some high hopes for us to get some pulls. And I wanna try try and show everyone off. But yeah, so we got the booster packs. We got the three breakthrough, as I said earlier, and then we've got the Ancient Origins pack and the Roaring Skies pack. So let's just go from Breakthrough through to Ancient Origins and Roaring Skies because they are the older ones and we want to, want to keep the old gold for last. Well, no, it's not really like old gold yet, but um, who knows, for the viewers in the future, this may um, this may be some old gold, <laughs> which could be pretty sweet. But there is the first code. I don't know why Breakthrough is written so weird there, but um, yeah, but yeah. There we go, and let's see if we can manage to, so we got five packs, so what would be the goal? I reckon 
two pulls, one ultra rare and one hollow would be solid to um, expect out of this kind of box. But I guess they, they throw in all the breaks and they might uh, be a little bit stingy on the pulls because of that, but who knows? Who knows? Or, we, or it could be really cliche and we could get some, um, some break action and breakthrough. Who knows? But we've got a pincer, a reverse Kulava with a mini eruption, and the rare is an Empoleon Hollow. Okay, nice start. That's cliche. Okay, I was talking about cliche, about throwing breaks in. But what about if they decided to go, oh, the theme of the box is Empoleon, so let's throw the uh, Empoleon Hollow from Breakthrough to go with the Empoleon Break. <laughs> but yeah, of course, they, of course they do that. Of course they do. But yeah, it's Empoleon Hollow with 140 HP with Dignified Fighter and Hydro Splash. Nice start. We we didn't have an Amity, like a classic Amity start today. We had a good start. Awesome, awesome, awesome. So we got the Mega Mewtwo Y pack up. Very promising to get a uh, pull on the first pack, but um, hopes aren't too high yet. Don't want to. If you got high hopes, you're always looking looking forward to a uh, disappointment. But um, we can hope and pray, regardless. But let's go. So second pack, we've got a Remoraid, a Snubble, Magnemite, Pikachu, Noibat, Town Map, Buddy Buddy Rescue, a Pancake, a Bomber Snow. That one is a Reverse Rare, not bad. And a monkey. Yeah, really anticlimactic, but that is okay. That is okay, because the first pack did come through, so a regular rare is expected. 90 HP with Water Fling and Hand Fling. Get out of my face, you monkey. Next pack. Breakthrough, a Zorok Break Pack Art. Zorok Break. I don't know what to expect from this pack. Maybe, who knows, maybe they'll throw in another Hollow or a regular rare. One in three packs would say would get a regular rare out of this pack, so let's see. So we've got a Remoraid, a Snubble, Magnemite, a Pikachu, Noibat, Cacturn, Wobbuffet, Frogadier, a Reverse Houndoom Spiritling, that one is just an uncommon, and a Staraptor Regular Rare. As expected, one in three packs, we got our Hollow, so we got the two regs. But yeah, Cyclone Slash and Brave Bird. Awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Next pack. Mega Titar from Ancient Origins. So, I'd, going off that, I'd expect one more pull out of these last two packs. So, let's see if it can my theory can be correct and we can pull a Ultra and a Hollow. That could be nice, that could be nice. Alrighty. So, we have a Beldum. Unknown. Porygon. A Spinarak. Meowth. Metang. Whoops, taking two cards. <laughs> Energy Recycler. Whimsicott. A Reverse Ligu, which is just an uncommon. And, and, and. A Golic Ancient Trait Rare. Rare. Rare, 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 rare. Regular rare. <laughs> With the ability double type and the attack superpower. So that, that is scary. That is scary. I always tend to do this. Like I buy these like really good boxes. Like for example, um, if you guys have not seen my Charizard um, Generations collection box. Really expensive box. One hollow coil out of the whole box. Ah, oh, please, please come through. Come through. The throwing skies. Just, a, just another hollow. Just be generous. Just be generous. Okay, so there we go. That is the final code of the opening. Enjoy, guys. Enjoy, enjoy. But let's see. Let's see if Roaring Skies can treat us very nicely for this last pack. Hopefully we can get a little bit of last pack magic. But we've got Togepi. A Ninkata. Tropius. Skyfield. A Rayquaza Spirit Link. Gallade Spirit Link. Reverse. And the final card of this Break Evolution box is... <laughs> no, Klefki. Why? Luke with Luffy Keys and play rough. Klefki. No. So yeah, once again, 
not the greatest box. Like the, I guess we did get some goodies in this one. I guess the the Charizard EX box we only got the uh, Charizard EX full art, but in this one they did throw in the jumbo, and we did get the three break cards, and we got a hollow. So. I guess, I guess, I guess, you can see the equivalence in value for this box. But um, yeah, so we got the code, we got the Break Evolution, Jumbo being the Empoleon one. But yeah, to recap this opening, we got the Abominus, Abominus, no, re um, Reverse Rare, I need to like, speak properly. <laughs> we got the Hollow Empoleon from Breakthrough, being the only pull of this opening. But then we've got the Freebie Promos. Being Empoleon Break with 170 HP, with, which is promo 134. I don't think I mentioned that before, but it is promo 134. Um, we got the Noctowl Break, which is uh, XY promo number 136. And then we got the Behim Break, which is 135. So what order does that go in? It goes Empoleon, and then it goes Behim, and then it goes Noctowl. Okay, so that's, that's in order. But yeah, yeah, so, um, overall, I'd probably rate the, um, Break Evolution box probably out of five. What would I give it? I'd probably give it, like, a, a two out of five. Um, just because of poor ratios, I think, from what I've seen, the poor ratios can be either really good or pretty, pretty average, which is, I, I got, like, pretty average being just the one pull plus all your, all your freebies. But, um, yeah, if you guys enjoyed today's opening, be sure to drop a like on the video. Let me know in the comment section below what you guys think of the Break Evolution box. I thought, I think it's a good idea. Um, seeing pr um, promos being the break cards was a nice little experience, and I thought it, it was pretty good. But yeah, let me know what you guys think. Subscribe if you're new to my channel, or if you just enjoyed today's opening. And I'll see you guys in another one of my Pokemon trading card game openings. Thanks for watching. Peace.